everybody, this is Andrew from Seam Labs, and in this tutorial we're going to look at making rounded bottoms with Swift in Xcode. So I've just got a blank single view application here. I'm just going to head over to the storyboard and we're going to add a bottom here. And what we're going to do, we're going to add a border around it and also make it rounded so it looks aesthetically pleasing to the person. So with the button here, just go to the assistant editor. I'm going to hold in the control key to link it up. I'm going to name it button rounded and connect it up. Now that we've done that, we'll go to our view controller code and I'll show you how to make the button rounded. So it's just a few lines of code, super simple. The first one is button rounded dot layer dot border color. We're going to set the color of the border to equal UI color dot blue color dot CG color. The next step is to set the width of the border because by default it's zero so you don't see a border around the button. So to do that, go button rounded. Once again, layer. Now border width equals one. So if I just quickly run that now, We'll have a border around a button, but it will just be a square border. Just to show you what it looks like. And in the next line of code, we'll make the button rounded so it looks really nice. Okay, so we've got the button here with the square border. The next one is to go button rounded dot layer dot corner radius. And we're going to set it to five. The higher you set it, the more the button will be have a bigger corner on it. So that's five. Now you see here we've got a slight curve in the borders, which looks really nice to the user. We say set that to 25. You'll see the difference in what increasing it does. You can see here it massively increases it until it reaches the middle and can't curve around anymore. So we'll set that back to five. Just one thing you may have noticed is this UI color dot blue color doesn't actually match the exact blue that the button text is. So to get it to be exact, what we'll do, we'll just comment that out and we'll have to set it using RGB, which is red, green, or blue. So we'll do button rounded dot layer dot border color equals UI color then we do in brackets and now you'll see one here with red green blue and alpha so for red we do 81 out of 255 green is 159 out of 255 blue is 243 out of 255 and alpha is 1 which is to transparency we want it to be fully transparent to the user and also we need to add .cg color at the end if we're setting any colors in the layer. So we'll run that now. And we can see here the text and the border color matches up perfectly. So it looks really nice to the user. And when they're tapping on a button, they know exactly where they can tap in because of the border. You can download the source code below. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe and leave any feedback below. Also check out our website, Facebook and Twitter by clicking or tapping any of the buttons on screen.